And in reply to ODM leader Raila Odinga's assertions in that radio and TV interview Thursday morning, Deputy President William Ruto has once again pointed the accusing finger at Odinga for what he says is wrecking the Jubilee government's development agenda. Speaking in Kuala County, the Deputy President told off Odinga for using the handshake between him and President Uhuru Kenyatta to break up the party. At the same time, the Deputy President and his allies took a swipe at the Building Bridges Initiative report, terming it unnecessary politics. The war of words over the Jubilee administration's performance continues to intensify as Deputy President William Ruto and ODM leader Raila Odinga trade accusations. <laughs> Deputy President William Ruto, while taking his hustler campaigns to the coast, blamed intruders in government for destabilizing the Jubilee administration from its big four development agenda. <laughs> Sambaratisha sera ya jubilee. Sera ya jubilee ilikuwa big four. Leo big four imewekwa nyuma ile iko mbele ni BBI. BBI haikukua kwa manifesto ya jubilee. Ruto said the former premier is taking advantage of the handshake to rock the jubilee boat. Mimi nilisikia ule jamaa wa kitendawili juzi anasema ati oh yeye Hajakuja jubilee yeye si jubilee yeye hajafanya chochote jubilee mimi nataka nimwambie my friend tafuta watu wa kudanganya kuja kwako kwa jubilee ndio imevunja chama ya jubilee mpaka leo jubilee imesambaratika wewe umekuja ukafurusha watu wote ambao walikuwa wa jubilee leo bunge kamati zote imeingizwa watu wa ODM Chairman wa finance ni mtu wa ODM. Chairman wa education ni mtu ya ODM. Sasa unatuambia amuko serikali kwa njia gani? Hizo makamati muko ndani mnafanya kitu gani? Raila has on several locations including his Thursday morning interview with Citizen TV's sister station Inoro TV and Radio criticized the deputy president for undermining the president. According to Raila, Ruto is part of the mess in the country and hands should take responsibility. Leading his hustler brigade in Nungalunga, Kwale County, the DB rebuked those opposing the hustler narrative. He maneno ya Wilbaro sio vile mnafikiria. It is a very serious and complex economic program. It is not what you think. Mimi nauliza watu wa Lungalunga. Kama alama ya chama ni Wilbaro na ile alama ya chama ingine ni mwavuli na ile alama ya chama ingine ni chungwa na ile alama ya chama ingine ni kuku tofauti ya hizi alama ni kitu gani mbona watu wanasumbuka na wilbaro mbona wasiulize hii kuku ni ya nini bbi ni muungano haramu ni muungano ya kutengeneza nafasi za watu kumi. sio nafasi zetu sisi Leo MCA wanapewa shilingi milioni mbili kinyume na katiba ya hii inchi ili wapasishe katika kaunti 24 ndio BBI iweze kufaulu. MCA yoyote leo natangaza MCA yoyote atakayepitisha kwa sababu ya ubinafsi na utumbo wake 2022 msimnyoe na wembe mumnyoe na chupa. Nilisikia ikiitwa nyoka na mimi nasema hivi, hii nyoka ikitoka pangoni ikifika kwenu mtaifanya nini? Mtaifanya nini hii nyoka? Tunaua hii nyoka ili kina mama waendelee kupata nafasi zao kule bungeni. The deputy president was in Kwale County to officially open Mwangulu police station at Mureni's chief office.